Hey guys, welcome. <laughs> welcome back to my channel. We have a true unboxing. Oh my goodness, don't show your address, Shannon. Don't show your address. We have a true unboxing because I've not opened this yet. <laughs> Today's video is going to be a wig um, review. Let's see if I can get into the box. So yeah, I've not even opened this yet. Um, I've not opened it yet. So this is from the wig company. I did purchase this with my own money. This was not sent to me for review. I purchased it. And there is a return label if you want to return it. But I did uh, buy one that was not returnable. So it, it's fine. And it does say on your little envelope, your invoice not returnable. <laughs> but the price I paid for this... I don't care if it's returnable because here's the thing I wanted it for the size I wanted to try it for the size so this was a final sale item and it's inside of a box and as you can see it is just a plain box on this one here's the information it is the striking and it is the shade where it says color 10 and it is a size large. So that's why I wanted to try it. It is a size large. My other wigs were size average. And I know they are too tight. And since this is final sale, she's just sitting in her little box. This was probably the one they may have used for a display or might have been a, um, something. But I know it's a little short curly wig. There is the cap construction it's not a lace front it's a basic front it looks like it has like a completely um done top there so i might be able to play with the top and then the wefted back the velcro extenders and then there is our tag that says striking number 10 and this is the size large, it says it on the back. So apparently I have a big head. And I do have a little ponytail going back here in the back. This is a little shorty. But it was curly and I thought it looked really cute in the picture. I'm just shaking it out. And it's just one color. She does have some permatease in there so you can fluff it up. Look, I know this is going to be silly. Maybe not, who knows. But I mainly wanted to try it for the size. I paid $17 plus shipping, which wasn't much for this baby. So, they did have quite a few um, open box wigs at the time. I don't have them on my wig grip. Oh yeah, I can definitely tell that fits a lot better finding my ear tabs and then we're just going to pull up <gasps> get my little bangs going here I don't think this is a heat friendly wig I have to go back and actually look at the original um, listing for a striking but you can do some styling with steam. <gasps> it's kind of cute. <laughs> I'm gonna rough it up a little bit. Because the bangs would definitely need a little bit of work. Cute. And since this is kind of very close to my base color, not the white, but my base color before it turned white, I can get away with letting my widow's peak show a little bit. This fits so much better than the average, and that's what I was wanting to see. It fits a lot better because my head measures out to a 23 and this said 22 and up I believe is what it said on the tag 
But my thing is, a lot of companies doesn't they don't do large caps. They don't do these budget friendly companies. They're not doing a lot of large caps. So we company, if you're watching this, please do more in large caps because I would buy more if you had them in large caps. Can I get that kind of behind my ear? Oh, yes, I can. I like it behind the ear. I would keep playing with this. Oh, yeah, there we go. Until it got like a side swept. I would just keep playing with it and playing with it. Until, there we go. Just like that. And just like this little curl that I'm not, that I'm not digging. My hair actually used to be kind of cut like this. It did. I'm not even playing. So, if you're interested in trying wigs, they did have a lot of open box styles. They had a lot of, seriously, they had a lot to choose from for open box. And like I said, let me cover up my information. If you can see that, it was $16.88 and then shipping. And I do like the color on this too. But you can you can make it as foofy as you want it. Or you can smooth it down. But I really like getting this bang to kind of lay down. Like that. That is cute. I like getting this like to come forward. So what you, you could do a little bit of steam to it and a rounded brush. Let me turn around and you can see the sides. Now that's my ponytail, so ignore the hump. You know how some people like to really fluff up that crown and get that crown like really big? It doesn't look bad on a round face like mine. It really doesn't. It's cute. And see that's my, that's my hair right there. So it's not, it blended in okay. That is super cute. Love it. That's what I love about a wig. I can go from long to mid-length to short like that. Just like that. Super, super, super cute. Oh my gosh. Alrighty, guys. As always, thanks for watching. This is super comfortable. This is a lot more comfortable than the average. That's why I was wanting to try a large. I wanted to see the back. Oh, it's got a nice curl pattern in the back. There's the back. Because I didn't get, really didn't get to see the back. That is cute. Yeah, I like them swept to the side.
And see, just from the heat of your hands, you can kind of manipulate it however you want to get it to go. Make sure I'm even. That's cute. I want to go show the hubby. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. As always, thanks for watching. If you're interested in a very affordable, well-made wig, be sure you check out the wigcompany.com. I will leave their link down below. I will leave the stats on this wig. They will have it as their regular stock. I will have to look up and see what the regular price for a new bought a new wig would be but if you can find it open box like i did it's 17 dollars. just it's under 17 dollars. all right guys i will catch you on the next one